Well, they got their start with Divine Comedy at BYU, and now they're featured in a sketch comedy series that has everybody laughing. Meet the core cast of BYU TV's Studio C, featuring clean comedy at its best. Well, I had a fun time, Natalie. Yeah, sure. Loser. I don't think we expected families to embrace it so much. <laughs> Guys, come quick, it's Dana. What happened? He's dead. <laughs> like kids that I thought oh they won't get it because they're too young or like this is my favorite show on TV so. you know I think this show really uh, tries to make an effort to to not only stay away from from unclean humor but also to include every as many people as possible on the joke so my dear I think it should only take few minutes for the entire world to know your exact weight <laughs> Uh, we don't do a lot of shock value humor here. Um, not to say that we don't do things that are surprising. I'm logging into Twitter. <laughs> Please, I beg you. I have many followers. I think that ultimately, when you give yourself restrictions and limitations, it's good for your creativity. Okay, guys, we need one more sketch, and we literally have 25 minutes before we go on. Any the four main any, cast members anything. write the sketches themselves. A lot of what we do is a lot like, isn't life like this, or uh, wouldn't it be funny if life was like this, sort of thing. A lot of the ideas I get come from life or kind of awkward situations, things that I'm insecure about. Sometimes I think you're seeing more of Whitney's life than my life. <laughs> It is my life. Um, I just, I have so many awkward experiences. Whitney Cole, come to die. So I thought, well, what if you were just doomed from the start with a blind date and you got set up with the worst blind date, Voldemort? Just water for me, thank you. And I will have a glass of snake milk. We only have Pepsi products. Jeremy, did you see there's someone else here dressed as a Ninja Turtle? It's kind of a gamble a lot of the time, and you have to get you have to develop kind of a thick skin. <laughs> Mom wants you to call her. Okay. And they're prolific. They have to come up with dozens of sketches to fill their 12-episode season. Somehow we, we make it work. We, we usually do about two scripts a piece each week. Oh, there he is! That was me. That was a little scary for everyone. Is he behind the pale woman? Or? The wig, definitely. That wig weighs about 10 pounds. Then there's the popular recurring shoulder angel. Hey, Sean, if you need a little extra edge on the court, you should try some of these. Oh, uh, I don't know, man. <laughs> and uh, at that key moment, shoulder angel pops in uh, in a cloud of smoke and explains that he is their shoulder angel and he's here to help. I have people that I prefer to climb because some are easier than others, some have wider shoulders to sit on. But not former NBA player Sean Bradley. I was sincerely exhausted by the time I got to the top. That was not an act, that was just me trying to finish the sketch. Every time we film it, yeah, it's about a little over 200 people in the audience. Man, it's such an energy. We, um, we really are grateful for the immediate feedback that we get from people who are watching these sketches. So, who's the funniest of the four? It depends on the day. And I would say we all bring something different. The funny thing about humor is it's all what you find funny. You know, I, uh, I'll always be true to Carol, so I'm gonna say Carol Burnett is the funniest. Um, so, sorry guys, hopefully we'll all measure up to her someday. <laughs> Pretty funny stuff. Studio C's second season has already begun. You can see it on BYU TV every Monday night at 8 o'clock. Well,